Um, as some of you may know, I did go and visit my family mid-October um, in Nevada. I just wanted to share some of that trip with all of you. So we did have a rough start with an unwanted passenger trying to make us late for our flight. The inside of the door. Can you please get it out here? But that's okay, we made it. I was super excited to see my family, but honestly, I was really sad to say goodbye to Guam. It did take about 24 hours total for travel. Also something pretty surprising, the food on the plane was pretty good. We really liked having our food and watching our movies, so that was really enjoyable. I think the trippiest thing was that when we left to go to the airport, the sun was rising, and then throughout our trip, I saw the sun set, and then I saw it rise again. It was so like weird but really cool to see so many sunsets and sunrises in like one long shot and then when we arrived we unpacked we took a power nap and then we just hung out for the rest of the night <laughs> suitcase suitcase All right, we've been in Nevada for a couple of days. My skin is dry, my lips are chapped, and my dandruff is back, hooray! <laughs> but today my mom's taking me to a pumpkin patch, so I'm so excited! Should we park over that way? It says parking. I know, but oh. there's hardly anybody parked over there. I guess we could park over here. I wanna park over here where there were cars. I don't, come on. It doesn't seem like you're in that skeeved out place All over right. there. Is it open? Does it look, <laughs> does it look open to you? <laughs> <laughs> this is part of the adventure. Okay. <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> and through the corn maze we go. How are you at navigation? I'm not stellar at navigation, honestly. I'm pretty sure at it. Uh, apparently this maze is supposed to be super hard. The lady says it only is like 15% of people make it out. Let's go this way. Look. Little, baby Little corn. Do you say wheelbarrow or wheel barrow? Wheel barrow. I always say barrel. <laughs> say it real fast. So you know it. <laughs> say it real fast. Wheelbarrow. Ooh. Corn. Two ways. Oh. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> I think we're doing it, Mom. I think we're. I think we're gonna be winners. <laughs> so we've made it to the river. <laughs> That's not where we're supposed to be. Going back in. How long do you think we've been out here? Um. Well, almost thirty minutes. Thirty minutes. <laughs> Our persistence will get us there. <laughs> is it a path? Let's look at this over here. Oh. <laughs> We're at the end. Yeah. So we we'll walk around the perimeter and find the exit sign and pretend that we made it out. <laughs> Cheaters never win, Mom. <laughs> so we're back. And that's where we came in at. Yeah. Well, we have gone to the very back edge to the front to both sides <laughs> i don't understand why we can't find this dang exit oh my god is this the exit I don't know. that's the entrance so oh my god we did it well after an hour of maze tromping <laughs> let's go get a pumpkin <laughs> we didn't actually end up buying a pumpkin my mom already had one at the house so i ended up just carving that one
few days later, we woke up and we decided we were going to go to another pumpkin patch for more spooky Halloween fun. Because all the pumpkins just are on dirt. This is much more lively than the abandoned like ghost town pumpkin patch we went to last time. Which one do you Oh my god, that one's so cute. Hey, handsome. Oh! <laughs> And just like that, the first snow of the year happened and Christmas spirit hit hard. Sweet Sweet Dylan flew up to visit as well as some of Joshua's friends and we got to try out this really cool speakeasy. And some of my family drove up from California to visit. We practically lived in the casinos. It was so much fun. I said goodbye to my family and Starbucks, and then we had one last goodbye brunch, and then it was time to head back home to Guam. It's 3 a.m. Time to go back to the airport to go home. After three planes and 24 hours, we are back in Guam. My skin is doing so much better already. I got my babies and I guess I'll end it here. Thanks for traveling with me. I hope you had a good time. Bye!